Hi, it's me. Um, it is 12.31 in the morning, and I just got home from work about an hour and a half ago, and I am exhausted. I don't know if you can tell, but I, I'm exhausted. I think I went to bed at 6 last night and woke up at... Crystal called me at 9. Crystal's my boss. That's her name is Crystal. And she asked me if I... Uh, she called me in, which it's kind of like this. Um, I have... I always work on Tuesdays. And I always work on Thursdays. Every Monday... Every other day, pretty much besides those two days, I'm on call. And so she called me this morning and told me that she needed me to work. And so... I got up or something. I don't even remember what I did. I think I went back to sleep. And I got up at noon and got dressed and ready for work. And then I went straight to work. And Avery got shots yesterday. And I don't know if you know this, but when a baby gets his shots, they are super tired. Like, the shot makes them exhausted. And so he was tired and kind of cranky today. And... Um, he didn't spit up any, which was really good, but, like, within the first hour I was there, I had to change his diaper, and he peed on me. Like, I took his diaper off, and I was getting ready to put the new one on, and he started peeing all over the place, and so I got pee on me, and I was not happy about that, but I fed him after that, and I was doing tummy time, which is, tummy time is when a baby is learning before they anytime before a baby can crawl you're supposed to do tummy time with them and it's just you do a certain amount of time where they have to stay on their stomach and it motivates them to crawl and so during tummy time I realized that he had pooped but he didn't poop he shit all over the place and it was like all up his back and it was so gross and I was supposed to give him a bath anyways so I just cleaned him off as much as I could and called it good and then Caden came home and Caden's a little con man I discovered because Caden told me that on the weekends he doesn't have to come in until 9 but the sun goes down at 8 15 and so he was just out running wild pretty much and then he came home and was singing this song about sandals and socks and it's like I got my sandals and my socks on or something like that and it's ridiculous and so we talked about that, and then he did a lot of funny stuff today. He's a real funny kid, and um, but I can't really remember because I'm tired. And yeah, that was pretty much it. I don't have to work tomorrow, and I don't have to work sun Sunday because I always have Saturdays and Sundays off. But I probably will work Monday and then Tuesday for sure. And then I'll have Wednesday off, and I'll work Thursday, and then maybe Friday I don't know if I'll work Friday but since I'm supposed to get off at 1030 and she didn't come home until 11 she gave me $80 today so yay and I think I might start tanning because I feel better when I when I tan like tanning makes me feel better and not like I'm sick or feel better but it makes me feel it rejuvenates me if I'm tired and whatnot tanning makes me feel better and so I think I'm gonna start tanning again but I don't know I probably won't do like a membership or something I might just do like a, a tan as you go thing so I don't know and I promised you I would go to bed early today so I expect a phone call cuz that was the deal is a phone call for going to bed at a normal time so normally you call me around two so I'll probably go to bed right after you call me if you call me but if not it's okay I know you're busy with work and whatnot and yeah I hope your day is getting better and things are getting less stressful for you I can tell that you're kind of that you're stressed out with work and everything and I just wanted to let you know that you don't need to be stressed out about work and whatnot I mean I know that it's like it's big now but in the you gotta look at the big picture you're only there for four months so 
somebody doesn't like you, fuck them. It's not like they're going to fucking, you're not going to be in this job for very long anyway, so fuck it. It doesn't matter. Those people can eat dicks because you're awesome. And yeah, um, I start school in two weeks, so my schedule will kind of change. Hopefully I'll get on a better sleep schedule with school starting. Actually, I know I will. Because I have hookers class at 9. So I'll have to be up pretty early in the morning. But yeah. Um, I do have. I said today's video is going to be more exciting. But it wasn't. Because <laughs> I'm tired. But I do have an idea of what tomorrow's video is going to be. And it is going to be 10 things that women do while their spouses are employed. And the, we're going to discuss the 10 ridiculous things that women do while their boyfriends are gone because I've discovered that I kind of do some stuff that it's like this is crazy it's just ridiculous and I'm going to make a video of me doing stuff like that and it should be pretty interesting I think I, ha I have the concept and everything of the video down pretty solid and yeah um if you need anything uh just let me know I have picked out a wonderful t-shirt and a pair of sunglasses that if you feel like spoiling Peanut, she would love and not be upset if you got her. Um, my teeth look really white today. Jeez. And yeah. Um, I love you very much. And I'm excited to talk to you again. And I'm excited for you to get your laptop if you ever get it. So, I hope you have a good day at work. I love you. Kisses.